G'day guys, I'm Biggest Kev and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to pan out this gold pay dirt which I've received from Andrew. Andrew uh, lives in New South Wales in Australia and Andrew's channel is That's Gold. I'll put this link up here. That's gold. So if you don't know Andrew and you haven't seen his videos, check him out. Yeah, he's he's got some really good videos on panning uh, in the rivers over in New South Wales. And he does, he finds quite a lot of gold. And uh, I just like to thank you, Andrew. Thank you for sending me this parcel of gold pay dirt. Thank you very much, man. Okay. I'll get to it. I'll set up my panning station and we'll see how much gold is in this material that Andrew sent me. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, guys, as usual. Oh, he's, lit. he's got me a note now. I better read it. Okay. Andrew sent me a little letter. Hi, Kev. This is from Nundal, Nundal River, I'd imagine that'd be. Um, recent episode with the big rock. A little further upstream, I pumped out a crevice. There is gold in it. I'm keen to see how much, um, how much gold that I'll get out of this material. That's gold, Andrew. And that's gold, that's Andrew's channel. Thank you very much, Andrew. There's the river, river sand, the material that uh, Andrew's kindly sent to me to process. Okay, let's get into it. Oh, I just thought I saw a speck of gold. <laughs> okay. Smart man. He's double bagged it. I'll have to go through the gravels. There might be some sapphires in amongst this stuff. Okay. There's a stone there. I don't think it's a sapphire though. But basically the same as what I always do um, with this material, just put it through a sieve and then pan the fine material because it just makes it so much easier to pan the gold or to separate the gold from the the rest of the material yeah the bigger stuff bigger gravels and stuff um, but i will i'll pan this oversize too and just see if we can get any any nuggets there might be some nuggets in amongst this stuff Okay, that's all the fines there guys. I'll be back once I set up my pan. Okay, here we are guys. The fine material that Andrew sent me. Oh, there's a lot of bubbles. A lot of bubbles in here. I don't know what caused it. I mean, that's could be the detergent I put in there. Yeah, and uh, thank you again, Andrew, for sending sending me this material, mate. I appreciate it. Appreciate all you guys, as I keep saying. Yeah, um, I'll be making up some things and sending you away, buddy. Good thing about this river sand, I mean, this material here, in particular, it doesn't have much black sand in it, so it makes it, I can, look at all the gold, I can see all the gold in the pan now. I can 
just see the gold starting to to rise up through the blonde sand. I've got to be careful with this stuff. And all the material that I'm panning out, as per usual, I'll repan it all. I'll do it again. I think that might do guys, I can see the gold start to start to rise up. Okay. Let's have a look here, eh? Let's have a look. See how much gold is in this material that Andrew sent me. Oh there's heaps of it. There's heaps of it mate. I tell you what that this was a bloody, uh, a nice, a nice crevice that you got onto, Andrew. There's heaps of gold there. You can see it all. I'll just put, I'll pull it all back and just give you as a quick look. I'll have to clean it up a bit better. There you go, guys. Check that out. Mate. I'll get back to you. I'll clean it all up and um, put it all in the pan. Okay, guys. I cleaned up all the gold um, out of the fines, but I'll still I can't I um, hang on to it because I'm gonna re I'll repaint it all again, and uh, I'm just gonna go through all this oversized now. Some of these rocks I'll be looking at because. Um, there might be some of those, those black rocks, um, some of the black ironstone rocks I might be able to polish up maybe. Might be a big nugget in here. Can't see any gold in there, but there might be some small pieces hiding in amongst this big stuff. I can see a piece. I can see. I can see a nice piece, guys. There is. There's a nice piece in there. Okay, that'll do. I don't want to take it down too far. I can see a nice piece of gold in there. Okay. Righty go. Let's reveal it, shall we? There he is. And, and the only piece, that big piece there. Beautiful piece of gold. Oh. He stuck to my finger, so he's a sticker. There he is, guys. A sticker, and um, I'll I'll run my microscope over this gold. I'll just show you how um, smooth or rough it is. This is a rough piece of gold. This piece, it hasn't it hasn't travelled very far, but um, under the microscope you can see if there's smooth gold, if it's travelled a long way, or if it's rough and jagged. Yeah, okay, guys. I'll empty out the stuff and bottle, and I'll get back and show you how much gold there is. Okay guys, there it is. I'll dry it out and I'll weigh it up and see what we get. There is a few bits of um, bits of sand and that mixed in with it, but yeah. Okay, I'll see you at the wrap up guys. Well guys, wasn't that cool? Some more gold. Thank you very much Andrew. Uh, I appreciate it mate. Um, here's the gold. That all is. There is a little bit of sand mixed in with it, but um, after this, I'll put a video up. I'll weigh it, weigh the gold, and um, just show you how much I get that Andrew Andrew um, has given me. Yeah, and um, Andrew, mate, 
you've got to go back to the spot where you found this gold because it's really, um, it looks like your gold that's been swept up off a jeweler's floor, mate. It looks like filings. It looks like gold filings um, under the microscope. Some of it's um, is rough looking pieces of gold. Some of it's curled up on itself and mate, um, I think there might be a source of gold where you found this and it's just being etched away by the water flow and rocks and that. Um, that's what it looks like to me. It looks like looks like gold filings, mate. Yeah, so um, yeah, dunno. Um, oh, I want to do a shout out. I'll do a shout out to Andrew. That's gold. That's Andrew's channel. And also, I want to do a shout out to to Kirk from Secret Creek Prospecting. Yeah, Kirk, Kirk's been a bit ill, um, and he's um, he's had trouble with his neck. Had a, he's uh, had an operation and all that sort of thing. And Kirk's from, oh, I've got to get this right, Idaho. Idaho, I hope that's right, Kirk. Sorry if I messed it up, mate. Idaho in, uh, in America. And I've got his sticker. Kirk gave me an idea. He said, why don't you put your stickers on the table where you do your wrap-up? And I thought, rightio. So I've got a couple of stickers here. Um, Ned's sticker and Kirk's sticker. They're the only ones I've got. If you want your sticker on your table, send me a sticker. <laughs> okay, um, I'll just give you a quick look at the at the gold. Uh, like I said, I'll put pictures up, guys. There you go. I hope you can see that. It's a little bit overcast this morning. Yeah, so, um, yeah, um, have a look at that spot, Andrew, where you found this, mate, because um, it looks like sweepings off a jeweler's floor, mate. You'll see what I mean when you see when you see the video. Okay. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for watching my videos. Take care out there, guys. And I'll see you on the next one. Hopefully I'm out bush. Okay, bye for now.